In this video, I wanted to show you how to quickly assign an existing routine to a client. When I say existing routine, one that is already saved in one of the general folders. You log in and then you go to the routines tab. Then the next step is to pick the correct routine. Say in the foam roller folder, the core stabilization routine. Okay, and then here you have the core stabilization routine with three videos. The first thing I want to do is to unselect the general folder. And then second thing, you pick the client. Okay, now at this point, the next step is to change the title. It's because you cannot save a new routine with a, an existing name. So for example, if I don't change the title and I save it as new, I get an error message. It says the routine name must be unique. This means that this name already exists. So all I need to do is to change the name. So I can just say put a number or I can put the name of the client whatever you like. And then at this point, you save the routine. Then you're done. You can verify that my client has the routine assigned. And here it is assigned to the client. And remember that an email goes out to the client, automatically it tells him that a new routine has been assigned to him. So no need to send him an extra email. Now let me show you one important thing, the difference between save as new and update a routine. So let's go back into our routines folder. I pull up the routine and I want to use the update button only when I keep the same routine. I just want to modify. For example, I want to delete a video or add a new video. But I don't want to change the title, and uh, I can also change the comments if I want to add the comments, but all I want to do is maybe add a video or remove a video. And uh, I, want, I don't want to save it as new because I want to update the existing one. So I click on update. And that's the only time you want to use the update button. Modify an existing routine. Same goes for a client routine. Well, my client. And let's modify this back and glutes routine. I select it. Now, all I want to do is remove some videos and add more difficult ones because the client is getting better and can actually do more progressive exercises. And the next thing to do is to update the routine. And you're done.